Hello everybody, this is Drake, we're back for more Hogwarts Legacy! And if you, well, if you missed the last session, we did, well, we did like the best quest in the game. We got the use of Deathly Hallows. Right, and now we're going to see what our BFF Sebastian wants. I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. Ooh. still one step ahead of us. They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. I did see another memory. This time it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient magic. But I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work yes. like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. They... Oh, either they don't trust you, or you don't care enough about Anne to ask the difficult questions. Of course I do. Of course I care, Sebastian. We've come this far. Don't let your frustration get the better of you. Fine. I'll defer to your keeper friends. For now. But I don't like it. We don't have a choice. Now, shall we see why the triptych led is here? Let's go, quickly, before we're spotted. Keep a close eye out. I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. I wonder why. Oh, when you go this Raiding, way. Raiding, I imagine. This mountain used to safeguard local hamlet valuables. Oh. It's been abandoned ever since Ranrock took hold of the coast. Well, we're going to liberate the coast right now, Sebastian. So check, so check all the hatred and frustrations be up past the door, okay? Oh, we got a fight coming up! Time for some goblins to die! Die! Oh, you wanna fight me, boy? Anytime you want to help, Sebastian. Die! Right, is that it? Oh, oh, it's that drill thing. Ah, they're drilling in here. Not making much progress, though. Alright, come on, let's get going. Oh, we could have just gone round. <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, overhead. Some consider them a bad omen. Ah, they're mm. not bad. Not everyone does. Yeah, not everyone thinks that way, Sebi. I know that. Yeah, you. you... <sighs> All right. I'm making small talk. I'm not going to trek up this mountain in silence. Mm. You, you sound a bit grouchy, dude. Chill. We're having a good time. Killing goblins, wasting Ranrock's loyalists. All right, I'm guessing this is where we need to go. Oh, wait, what's this? Ooh, this is a barrier. Oh, come on, dude, you're slower than a snail. You know, you're you're the one in an urgent rush here, not me. You're the one that wants to get this all done. I bet the Thestral nests close by. Probably. But we're not. You trespass. There they are. Revelia. Wait, we should have some sort of plan. I'm through planning. Oh, oh, my. yeah. Look, look at the Sebastian. Look at him, Sebastian. Look. Oh, I killed. Oh, no, damn it. Oh, really now? Oosh. Well, technically, I'm not outmatched. Wait, why is he not taking any damage? 
<laughs> took damage from that though, didn't he? Nope. Do you intend to die? Crash. You're gonna what? You're gonna what? That's right, you're gonna die. Damn right they did. What were you thinking? I was thinking about dead goblins. You could have got us killed. But I didn't. Ooh. Looks like Branrock's loyalists were heading further up the path. Let's keep going. I don't know. I think he's been a bit reckless here. I mean, I can take him on, but yeah, this is this is not going to go the way he thinks it's going to go. I don't know, Sebastian. I think you're being a bit reckless Branrock's here. Branrock's going to make everyone pay. Anything made from goblin silver belongs to us. Whether it's a sword or a repository... Whatever that is. Revelia, did you hear that goblin? Ridiculous notions of ownership. Oh. <laughs> uh, in the mood for a bit of rock? Oh, come on. Chop, chop. Can't do it on my own. Well, I can, but... Such arrogance. Brush. No! I will make you... Die! Revelio. Feel free to help out any time. Like, God, oh, dude, you like ticking me off now. You're ticking me off. You do. You've been grouchy. You just been contradicting. You're not thinking things through. This sort of recklessness is what gets you killed. At least I think things through when I attack. I plan my moves meticulously. I agree. Only good wizards are dead wizard. Ranrock's got that right, and I'll be most keen to help him achieve his goals in that regard. Oh, I won't <laughs> This must be it. Oh, hang on. There's a Sebastian, blue thing here. Wait. Wait? For what? Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen to me. I know you're angry and frustrated, but charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lodgok said... Oh. Your goblin friend? Yep. Stop it. That's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing. To find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lodgok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me. Or I don't see that we can continue together. Oh, damn. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. That's Good. right, so you got to play Ranrock by my rules. more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right. Not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Agreed. Ooh, well, technically I'm the one that charged in head first in our battle, not him. Better get that. Travels, my young friend. Same to you. Right, let's get in here. Do, 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 do. The tower tunnel. I don't know, Sebastian. Yeah, he's he's got he's getting a bit reckless. I know I was the one that was charging in fighting the goblins, but yeah, it's me in there. I can I can I got ancient magic. I got everything I need to magic the goblins. But Sebastian does not. Oh god, oh god, these freaking spiders. Why is it always gotta be spiders? spiders. How fitting. Hello! Ugh. I've honestly had enough of these spiders. They're just annoying. More spiders. Oh, hang on. No, no. Oh. Right, time to die. 
die, but die. Oh god, it's a big one. Um, um, I got it. Crucio. Now, who did that? Alright, we need to take out Sunshine up there. Ah! Whoosh. Whoosh. This one, Sebi. Bombarda. Ah, almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Yes, but you didn't do it yourself, did you? You had my help. I could do it on my own, but uh, you definitely not. These spiders are determined to make a meal of us. Damn right I'm they sure are. I'm sure we taste better than a goblin dinner. Well, I don't know. Get this moonstone. Oh, we've defeated enough spiders. Wait. Oh, oh, bugger, there's more behind us. Annoying little beasts, aren't they? Yep. Revelio. Oh, got some man-made structure here. Oh, hang on. What we got here? The staircase leading here. Whatever for? Didn't he? I don't think anyone's been here for ages. Confringo. Because of all the uh, rocks. Right, destroy these bloody nests Rebellion. quick. Look uh -oh. at this place. It's like an arena. Not really my style. A bit much, if you ask me. Defeat all enemies. Ah! Chinese chomping cabbages! Go! Oh, nice! Stop them going into the ground! Die! Oh, no, no. Ah, oh, damn it! We need spiders to attack it! Ah! Die! Boosh! Right, you can die. <laughs> oh, there's a big one. Ooh, oh, anvil. My favorite one, this squishy spider. Look at these guts. Spider guts. I'm admiring my kill Getting spider. The cavern can't have been the only challenge. Perhaps we should search for runes. Oh, hello. Well, I know how to do this. We've seen rune symbols like these before. Correct. Confringo. Can't get out of here quick enough. No. Revelia. Why do they have to be spiders? Why can't it be butterflies? Oh god, they're giving us Wigan Well potions. You know what that means. We're gonna have to fight something big. Oh, it's a troll! Oh, okay. Ah, what do you do? Oh, not what he's expecting. Well, I killed the troll in Hogsmeade, so this troll should have no... I should have no problems with this troll. Oh, hang on. Wow. Whoa, Crucio has no effect on him, but it enables me to deal damage to the others. I mean, technically I could use Imperial on him, but nope. Ow! Ow! Oh, 
Ah, I've got my ancient magic now. Whoa, 15,000 damage. Boosh. We take the spider, Sebastian. I'll take the big guy. Ow. No, oh, I'll help you. Ah, I'm trying to help Sebastian. Oh, good, the troll's dead. Boosh! Is that it? <laughs> teamwork, Sebastian. Nice teamwork. Nothing like an angry troll to bring friends together. Nope. <laughs> Oh, I guess we're going to have to repair that, maybe? Repair it. Bloody trolls. Messing everything up. Piece of work. More than one. Revelio. Woo! Well, we're going to loot this place for a start. Okay, I'm guessing we're gonna need. Oh, hang on! No, no. We can jump high enough to reach that ledge if we try. We got another journal. Oh, it's a long one. Okay. Such joy I felt helping my father after all these years to hear his voice again. I cannot begin to describe how much I've missed it. I confess I was wholly stunned by the keeper's reaction. I should have expected it. How can they stand by and do nothing when they have the power to do so much good? Who is Professor Rackham to tell me what I can and cannot do with my ability? The audacity of all of them, judging my work without any real Maybe understanding sturdy to stand on. of all that I've accomplished. I do have some hope. The headmistress seems somehow to understand what I was doing. When the time is right, I shall go to her. She may be able and willing to help. Until I know otherwise, I must continue my work alone. For now, but I will find someone to help me. I will find someone else who understands the gift that we've been given and our obligation to use it. I will store what I learned safely away for the moment. One day, I will be able to share with another who is like me. Ah, oh, interesting. Did you find something? A journal entry. Isadora was here. Right, uh, we need to get up there, so... I'm assuming we put you over there. Ninja climbing. Come on, Sebastian, get your ass up here. I'm out of breath after all of those stairs. But the view, well worth it. Indeed it is. Ooh, hang on, we got another bit of parchment. We can blast through it, I'm certain. Ooh, another journal. Right. I feel more and more capable each day, my sense of purpose, knowing that what I am doing is precisely what I was meant to do, has never been clearer. The number of souls I've been able to help grows by the day. So much pain. And I have discovered that this magic itself somehow confirms that what I am doing is right. Each time I breathe in the haze, even a little, it's as though I become more capable. I am being rewarded for my courage, rewarded for using this magic the way it was meant to be used. I fear, however, that I must find a way to store what I cannot use in the moment. I do not yet understand its power and do not want to leave it to chance. I have an idea. It is not worth without risk, but I feel that the risk is worth it. Ooh, interesting. Good news? This journal entry sounds worrisome. Hmm. I wonder if one of the repositories is all the ancient magic that she's Almost stored. Almost as good as if I'd done it myself. Yep. Revelio. Shouldn't be too this hard. This place can't have belonged to only Isadora. Oh, we've got another one of these doors to open by the looks of it. Revelio. 
with the third one. Symbol. Feel as if I should be fluent in runic language by now. You probably should. Bombarda. Hang on. Do these two first. I should do it. Oh, we found another journal. How could I have been so terribly wrong? The headmistress won't help me. I try to make her understand. She, like the others, is blind to the possibilities of what I can do. I have come to learn that I can rely on no one. But I am a more powerful witch than I have ever been, and I know that it's due to the work I'm doing. I shall not allow my magic to lie dormant as the Keepers do. How I despise that ridiculous name. As if keeping power all to themselves is something to be lauded. I confess I have begun to wonder if I will ever find another in my lifetime with whom I can share this work. If I do not, then I shall find solace in the knowledge that I have left them a trial to follow. A path from which they can learn. Perhaps they will do what I cannot. Heal the world. Or if you're me, rule the world. <laughs> I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. I wish you could see one of her memories. Revelio. I think we might be about to get that wish, wish, Sebastian. Ooh, wait, there's another journal? The final canvas piece Oh, we got it. We've done it. Yeah, we did it. Isadora should not have had to keep all this secret. I know from the memories I've seen that the Keepers and Isadora didn't see eye to eye on the use of ancient magic. Yes, you magic. just said that. But I don't understand why she seems to have gone to such great lengths to tell her story without their knowledge. I wish you could see one of her memories. Yes, so you said I. that. Perhaps completing the triptych will shed more light on all of this. Well, I hope so. Nor can I. Oh, gotta place it on there. Ah, it's the middle piece. This is it. Don't keep me in suspense. Go on, place it. I think we're going to see a pensive. Maybe. <laughs> Nothing's happened. We did all that for nothing. Oh, no. Spoke too soon. Another pensive. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. Oh, only one, way to find, only one thing to find out. What is it? Let's find out. I cannot bring my brother back, Father. But I can give you peace. Have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father, these are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. Thank you. A 
That worked. It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. I need something much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but if used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this? Unnerves them. Well, everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. Someone will be. Oh dear. She took away the pain. I knew it. No, Sebastian, I knew don't there was do a way it. To help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. Something no, something's not right. What do you mean? You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. Oh. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. We have seen that view before. The abandoned home in Felcroft, the destroyed painting. It was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes, yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. I'm not sure that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain... It's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care. If at all... If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Please, talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then for Anne. Why did the Keepers want to keep Isadora quiet? Why destroy her portrait? She must know something that they don't want us to know. Oh, that's it. We did it. Hmm, interesting turn of events. Right, we're going to talk to Sebastian and see what he has to say. Hello, buddy. Sebastian. I can't believe my uncle wants to leave Felcroft. <coughs> Wait, what? Anne's going to stall him. She must. We need time. No, you time. can't leave Felcroft. For what? I've learned more about the relic. Ooh. I cross-referenced Slytherin's spellbook with everything in the library on relics and dark sacrifices. Sacrifices? That's when I something. I believe the relic hmm. will only work inside the catacomb. I don't like the sound of that. So we have to get Anne to the catacomb and then conduct a sacrifice. Seems risky. Look, It'll be look, worth look at the my risk. Coat. Just blow it in the wind. Maybe convincing ominous. Ugh. Anne will only get a chance I'm, if he's on board. Ominous. And we have to keep all of this from your uncle. If he goes to the headmaster, we could be expelled. Well, that headmaster don't care about us using time. dark magic. As for my uncle, he's not an aura anymore. What he doesn't know, well, won't hurt us. I suppose, but... Do you think your uncle would hmm. tell anyone at the Ministry about all of this if he found out? If he found out, I doubt he'd go to the Ministry. He didn't part ways with them well, from what I understand. Salvation he always say, seems to come with a I cost. I believe his strong aversion to dark magic has something to do with his time there. Anne thinks he once decided to fight fire with fire, so to speak, and resorted to using an unforgivable curse and fight against dark wizards. I mean, at least makes that's what sense. she thought she heard. When he realized what his job had led him to become, he left rather abruptly. Ah. So, I'm not sure he'd go so to the ministry to report on his own family using dark okay, magic now. Okay, now it, that kind of makes sense why he was so insistent that Sebastian doesn't use again. the unforgivable. I shall let you know when the four of us want meet to make the, the same mistakes that he did. Now. Well, that was an interesting conversation. Right, we're going to talk to Natty now and see how she's faring. Ooh, our Christmas trees! Ah, I have been meaning to speak with you. Hello, Natsai Onai. 
I still can't believe we escaped the Ashwinders. You may not realize it, but you are the talk of the school since you saved me that day. Oh, really? I wonder how everyone knows about it. I told my mother in the hope that she would be I posted more it on YouTube. That's how, that's how everyone knows it about it. From me. <laughs> she likely told other <coughs> professors, and <sighs> news travels quickly. Unfortunately, she might, in fact, have been even less forgiving than I'd hoped. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yeah, she should. If she knew more about what you've done, I suspect she'd be proud. If she yeah, knew more maybe. about what maybe I've not. done, she would never let me out of her sight again. I'm sorry. Has Officer Singer done anything with the evidence we provided? She has not. Halo is as strong as ever. Someone needs to stop him, whether it is us or Officer oh, Singer. Oh, stop relying on Officer Singer. She's absolutely like useless. Billyland, my father would be alive today. What exactly happened to your father? It was a beautiful day. My mother had gone to tend to a neighbor who was ill, and so my father and I were galloping in the savannah. Galloping? Your father was also an Animagus, I take it? He could become the most majestic giraffe. Ooh, and he would carry me on his back, my arms around his neck. We were on our way home when we surprised a group of bandits who had come from our village. Oh, that's One not of good. them saw me just as he removed a scarf from his face. He shouted and then aimed his rifle. Oh, you mean they didn't, he didn't use want once? You to identify him. Exactly. In an instant, my father bowed his neck to protect me and was hit. As he fell, my oh, father shot back into his human form. When the bandits saw this, they turned and ran in fear. I mean, Magic terrified I suppose them. it is in and the then neck, he I was guess. Gone. <sighs> and it was all my fault. Uh, fault. In what way? How so? He died protecting me. If I had been capable Dude, of protecting you were like, myself, what, five? he would still be alive today. My mother and I tried to go on without him, but it became too much for us there. A few years later, we left to come to Scotland. Hmm. Do you think taking down the Ashwinders will avenge yeah, your father's this, death? This... No. Vengeance is not what drives me. My father would not want that. He and my mother raised me to believe that it is a privilege to be able to fight for those who cannot. Fair I know enough. There is risk involved, fight for those without a voice. It is worth it. I can respect that. <laughs> I am glad you seem to think so too. What does your mother think about all of this? Oh, she's well, against it. As you saw, she worries a great deal. She is an excellent seer. But I think it bothers her to this day that she did not see my father's death coming. Oh, she's not very good then, she is she? Him. But, you know, as many I. things in life cannot so be predicted. So I believe on some level she understands my need to seek justice in a small way. But that does but not mean that she likes it. But in a world with magic, you know, seeing the future is really beyond, is it? Oh my... That is a good question. In theory, yes. Although he would worry as my mother does. But I think he, of all people, would understand my persistence. My father never shied away from a fight for good, no matter how ruthless the Just fall. like me! And I think he would have enjoyed knowing that I had a compatriot like you. Dude, I've been doing all the work. I've been carrying I'm you sorry, on my Natalia. back now. I can't imagine what you've been through. Your father sounds exceptional. He was. Truly extraordinary. I can, I, hey, listen and to me, thank you for your I can take words. down Ranrock, Harlow, Rookwood, my father and their little piss the patrols yes, all by remember, myself. Rain does not fall on one roof alone. Exactly. That's right. Soon you and I will put an end to the Ashwinders, beginning with Harlow. And once he is gone, and when it we rains, will turn our it attention pours. to Rookwood. We are making progress, and we will succeed. A very nice conversation here to end thank this session. Thank you again for saving me. You deserve all of the praise you That's have That's right, I do. Right, but we're ending the session here, so till next time, ta-ta.